about to die. That's the wrong button. Yay! We got it back. We got it back. We back. We back. We back. She back. She back. Hold up. Come on, Instagram. I accepted it, right? Okay, there we go. And she's back. Hello. Fantastic. So, please bless us with more beautiful words and important stories. We are ready. Indeed. Um, I'm going to pour libations and then I'll, um, I'll get into some poetry. Fantastic. I'll, I'll do, and you, a poem mm -hmm. is good? Okay. All right. Um, ya Asintewa, Ashe. Ashe. Harriet Tubman, Ashe. Ashe. Maya Angelou. Ashe. Ashe. Sandra Bland. Ashe. Um, for my friend Valencia. Who was escorted from the courtroom as she reached for her husband after sentencing. She watched in horror as they carted him away for a 3,650 day cage stay that day. A white male with three prior violent convictions who was convicted of the same exact crime received 10% of the time. And even those 365 days will not be served in the cage, he got probation. This nation does not deserve my poetry, but Valencia's husband does. May it envelop him like a warm hug. May every letter band-aid the severed humanity of his existence may love. Travel the distance to deliver these kisses of mourning so that his mornings are plagued with thoughts of whether or not his autistic daughter has forgot that daddy loves her. May this poem communicate daddy loves her. May this poem commemorate the day. I decided that it's okay that I'm not okay. I'm disgusted with myself. And the way I carried on with business after Lil Rob's little brother was pulled from a ditch and the police referred to him as the suspect instead of Terrence on the news. May this poem commemorate the day I took a break from coordinated obligations to be patient with my son. May this poem be considerate of my health. May this poem be the moment I need to escape, to take it all in, fall apart and built again. May this poem be the crumpled piece of paper in the pocket of Francis Scott Key as he watched his country burn from the belly of an enemy ship. May this poem be a legendary gift. May it anthem a story of triumph and glory. When I fall silent, listless with trauma and depression, may this poem be the progression of my healing and the restoration of my voice. May this poem be the noise that awakens my restless spirit. May I feel it enough to memorize because most days as of late, I've been off page. My psyche self-preservation has presented its interpretation of current events with a side of Novocaine. I am not the same brand of sensitive I once was. I am touch behavior. I'm afraid my human nature is evolving. Right. New adaptations falling short of empathetic capabilities as a means to survive the news feeds, mm. the timeline, the bodies. The absence of justice is the very presence of terror. I am being terrorized into numbness and numbness is why I stopped drinking in the first place. I wanted to get my emotions straight. I wanted my feelings back and yet I still lack the emotional aptitude to react to the current state of the union because I am a leader. I am often ashamed to admit that. May this poem admit that. May it be my humility. May this poem be painfully honest. One of my imwaza sent me a text the day a man was lynched in Piedmont Park. 
Do your heart ask me why? Does everything suck? And the only answer I could muster up was because we're black. And I don't remember the exact moment the hope fled from my eyes, salty and wet, slapping my face with peaceful protests and violent deaths, marches and stand your ground assassinations, visuals and acquittals of officials salaried with taxpayers' debt who took an oath to serve and protect. And yet, thousands of Americans dead at the hand of law enforcement this year. My tears have deserted me and dropped. Mm -hmm. There once was a time I cried at the thought of Tamir Rice and his sonless mother. My hands used to hover over the darkness in my belly. The memory of my empty stomach would plummet me to abysmal grief. Sometimes I considered the abortion I had at 19 and called myself a hypocrite. Another black boy told to death by those who play God for fun or fear. I still have nightmares about these 16 years I did not spend raising a kid in this world where early graves are flower beds that lay to rest the headstones of young bones of strange fruits plucked from its mother's incompetent arms. We are unable to keep our children from harm mm -hmm. or death mm -hmm. or prison mm -hmm. or poison. May this poem be more than an admission of my guilt. May this poem be a remission of my baggage. I've been run ragged by the brunt. I am so broken and defunct, and I wish it were just a funk or bad mood, but I feel bruised and damaged and lifeless. I've lost my nerve. I feel nothing. May this poem touch me. I need something to matter. May this poem shatter my post-traumatic stress. May this poem allow me to decompress and release. May this poem allow my Black life to matter. At very least, at very least, at very least, at very least, to me. Yes. Yes. So we are whole and complete. Yes. We are divinely capable. Yes. Life is blessed by our presence. Yes. And we are present. Mm -hmm. And we are ready. And we are willing. And we have everything we need. And we are everything we need. And we create everything we need. So it is. So shall it always be. We manifest our dreams, aspirations, and realities. We love and approve of ourselves. We are wealth. We attract wealth. We accrue wealth. We distribute wealth. We recreate wealth. We possess joy. We spread joy. We are joyful. Ashe. 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 Wow. That was amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you. That was Thank you. Fantastic. Thank you. Wow. Thank you so much. Man, that was an amazing conversation. Something I didn't even realize I needed. I was pretty. I, I enjoyed it very much. <laughs> I enjoyed it very much. And I'm so glad that we got a chance to talk. Definitely. Thank because you. Because so often that doesn't happen. Exactly. Um, and we are so far apart geographically, but here we are. I know. It's just the, the amazing things technology can do when it wants to be amazing but you know yeah that's on the people but thank you so much thank you for everybody that came in and thank you again for just providing some words providing some guidance providing some light in our times because we all really need it we all truly need it and i hope everything is going well on your end i hope the best for the future endeavors and everything that is going to come yeah. and i do in person like that'll be amazing oh, i look forward to seeing you in person Fantastic. and it is sooner than than we all expect truly truly and i hope you have a good one all right you too blessings see you guys <laughs>